Hi guys, I'm on a trail with a no hunting zone area. I'm right by the lake over here. Uh, we're going to walk this trail. It's about a mile long. Um, recently, last year in, two, in some time, we had a sighting on this trail that I was informed of. Uh, I don't know all the details. And we're going to go on this trail because I only, I had probably been on this trail maybe once in my entire life. But uh, we're at Salt Fork State Park and uh, it's going to be a great day. We got the sun coming out. It's around 12:30 in the afternoon. Got to go down these steps here and um, do some hiking. Got Nat Man and myself and uh, Mike over there. They're going over a map in the vehicle parking lot, and uh, we're going to see what we can come up with uh, in this area. So I'll get back to you in a little bit. really good. There's a cave area coming up over here. But... It's so quiet and peaceful. Those guys are playing around behind me if you hear any howls. Uh, they're doing uh, some calls, I guess. We got a creek that goes through here. Part of the trail. I like the sound of the water, guys. I don't know if you do or not, but it kind of relaxes you a little bit. The flow. Okay, Mike's on. Go ahead and repeat that. Where are you at, Mike? A yellow coat. Oh yeah, that's Nat Man, not me. I see you. Okay. Lake uh, Trail, and right across is a cave area. Of the park. What was that, Mike? Find him. Okay, we're gonna leave it at that. We'll get back to you in a little bit. Hey guys, this is an update. Uh, Nat Man and Mike left me alone on this trail. They're already to their destination. Um, I'm all by myself. The wind is at my back. The lake is at my back here. It's my back door here. And uh, just uh, sitting up here and uh, trying to get myself together here. Been here alone for about 10 minutes now. And that's a little bit different than usual. Um, usually I have somebody in front of me and back of me, but uh, we're definitely uh, spaced out and uh, between apart. Uh, got a beautiful day. It's a little cool today. Over there on the other side, it's uh, the cave area that I'm showing you. Water's flowing here. Breezy here. Coming around this rock here. Beautiful rocks here. And I'll get back to you in a little. Interesting area that I'm at. 
I'm still on this trail trying to meet up with the, that man and Mike. And uh, I seen that man down there. Doesn't know I caught up with him. Hey, that man! Hey! Hi guys, this is Blue Tracker again. Coming up on the lake here, uh, the trail here. I want to show you most of the stuff here. The water is kind of these trees. You come up to it and you look for something, maybe something walking or something with footprints down in here. And uh, you get these things growing. Kind of a little different. where I just came from off the trail back there. I'm right by the water. These trees are in the water. I'm sure you see that. This crow's been following us with the polka music and everything else. <laughs> All right, we're having a fun time out here. <laughs> hey, what's happening? Hey, yeah, yeah, yakshamash. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. There, man. The guy with a stick, and you got a Bigfoot stick? Hey, Mike, how you doing? You're live on the air, buddy. Don't put me on YouTube. You're gonna be on YouTube, no, buddy. You know I'm not. Oh yeah, Mark. No, I'm not. Yeah, you already no got the big stick, man. Big, you guys are crazy. Yeah. Okay, we're out here in the wildlife area here. We're moving pretty steady here. We got Tall Tower, we got Mike. Right. He's up in here front here. And we got Man Man here and Blue Track. Uh, we're going out in the next expedition here. Salt Fork State Park. Uh, we're going to go look for some prints in the swamp area um, of this wildlife area. We got some pokers running here, so we can get ourselves going here. Thank you, money. Music in the background. You can see anything, anytime. Anything that can pop out on the road. We see turkeys and deers. They tell them which way we got to go here for the pretty soon. house this morning when we parked. And, um, so we got a lot, lot of things going on here in the wildlife area here. You can see in the window there's a little back seat of the uh, track of you. Uh, it all started down. Oh, was it a left? Yeah, it was left. Yeah, it was left. Oh, we got to back up. That must be where the knob is. Yeah, that was the that was the knob we went. Remember, we got the we got the uh, ticks. the ticks all over us that one summer. And uh, we're going up here and here and uh, passed up the road. These folks, they know where we're going. Yeah. yeah. It'll be all right. It'll be okay. Knowing them, we're coming down this road here. Well, this would be fun in the winter time. Especially at night, man. You got something coming out here. That's why never come down here. This. You're gonna mess up your underneath. Huh? I've been on roads like this over my head. Go halfway in that chair. Oh my god. I'm talking about roll the windows down. Your whole bottom is crazy. Mine doesn't turn. So we're just talking about the road and how the uh, area is uh, in the wildlife area here. Okay, we're going to leave it at that, and we'll get back to you guys later. Uh, it's been, been, been a pleasure so sightseeing uh, out here in the wild up there. I don't get this, be able to see something across the road, right? Once I see it, then I'll come back and worry about getting a picture of it. Yeah. I just want to see it. All right. That's what we got to do. That's why we're out here. There ain't nothing back here. In the woods. There's no reason for anybody else to be back here, period. Nope. Nope.
There ain't no houses, there ain't nothing back here. No, nothing just, at all. Just woods. Lots of it. That's what I'm saying. You never know what you're going to come across. No trails. This area is for the uh, mostly wildlife. Yep. Good for hunting. The hunting season's all year round. No, no. no. We're in the no hunting time right now, as far as I know. Right. So groundhog. Right. The groundhogs. Yeah, you can hunt groundhogs in there. Groundhogs, yeah. groundhogs, 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 coyotes, coyotes. Yeah. They're letting this is mating time, so they don't want you to kill us stuff right now. Yeah. I like looking for tree twists, anything. Anything out of the order. Never see them, never see tree twists down here though. It's weird. When I was, at, probably no when I was in uh, LBL, there were, were definite twists on the tree. Really? In spots. Usually on turns like this. Okay, we're going to leave it for curves. We're in the uh, swamp area, the Bigfoot thing. Tall Tower, myself, Blue Tracker. So we got Mike, he's taking a picture of the swamp. We got Nat Man. We got another team coming. Up the road here, but we're gonna look for some swamp prints. That's, that's the main thing we're out here for, is prints that are, that are on the ground. So we got Terry and Treva, we got Mike. We got, here comes rolling the team. Um, we're down here during the day, it's around 5.30 in the evening. We'll try to hit this uh, before we do any other areas. So, this is the sound of what you're going to do. It's what you have. So, all our team members are here. Uh, we're going to look for some swamp prints at the end, that's about it. Wow, that was Better let you know. Blue yeah, tracker, we'll get back to you later in another clip. Yeah, that's, that's where I found that footprint was back here. Okay. Okay. So we're coming up to the ridge area during the day. It's around 6 o'clock in the evening. Um, we're going to check this out later tonight for a night, night expedition. And uh, we're going to see what happens around these trees, this area. Hey, what? How much fucking memory you get on that tree? You were filming all day yesterday. Uh, they're doing some calls. Hey, keep going, Nat. You're going to look over the valley. Yeah. Beautiful area out here to stargaze and to do anything you want. It goes on for miles. Oh! You see those full offs back here and here? Mm -hmm. We come here tonight and we'll like, be quiet first and be pitch dark. Yeah. Half of us can go to one one, half can go to the other. See the pine over there? Pine tree. Yeah, see. Look at that. Whoa. Okay. We're gonna do some expeditions yeah, we'll tonight. Come on, we'll put this in the floor. I mean, we'll turn that around. Okay, we're just gonna leave they it. They can probably pick us up if they don't come out here. We'll be at the handicap spot. Come back here. Into a new venture or what? <laughs> Where are we headed out to? Pines? Yep. The sec first or the second? This is a night video. First one. We're catching live. On Look at it, use the brights. Yep, that's pretty good road here over up in the wildlife area. That's all you can see in front of us. Trees are warning. Goodbye. There, there goes the tree there. So you never know what you're going to come across like coming up the road here. Should I use a flash through the windshield? What are you going to do? Or my headlights be okay? Your headlights are okay. Right now. You got bright ones? You got fog lights? No, I just got the brights on. Okay. Rabbit. spooky out here. And it's only 8.30 at night. Oh. Yeah, man, man, what you think about this place? It's, uh, 
kind of scary out here. It's pretty dark out here. But well, we'll be okay. We picked the right night to come with this moon. Yeah, the moon is kind of oh, like a pumpkin orange. Yeah, the higher it gets, the wider it'll get. Right. Which way? Left. Ooh. Oh, we got to that one fork in the road already. Oh boy. Where did you see blue lights? To my left. To my left. But it's yeah, it's okay. Yeah, I don't need to. Alright, we're gonna leave it there until we get to our destination. Yeah, we gotta give them a chance. Hi guys. Uh this is the end of the uh weekend here. Uh, I'm up in the woods with Nat Man and myself. Um we had a great weekend in a cabin. A few researchers we met and friends that came up to see us and do a little bit of research. Um, but right now I'm sitting up on the top of a of a hill, and uh, the lake is uh, the view. It's, it's beautiful. It's 11:30 in the morning almost, and uh, I just thought I'd end this with a little clip of the ridge area of my 360. I'm going to see what we got up in there on the ridge. The view. So I just thought I yet. Uh, Alright, we just thought we'd let you know. And that man's over there around the corner. We got this big rock behind me. So I just thought I'd let you know about this. Uh, weekend was a great weekend. And I need new batteries for a camera. So. <laughs> we went through a bunch of a bunch of batteries because of the cold weather at night. So take care till another episode of uh, in the woods uh, searching for the creature that we call Bigfoot.